Hiking Delight Peak. Parking for the start of the trail is at 6,000 foot day use area, which is 29.6 miles from Interstate 210 via Angeles Crest Highway. From there, a use trail heads up the slope where Delight Peak and Double Delight Peak sit on a ridge overlooking the San Gabriel Wilderness. The difficulty rating for the hike is moderate. The hike begins. Picking up a used trail after crossing the dirt road adjacent to the day use area. The trail elevates the lower slopes of Delight Peak. A clear view of Delight Peak appears directly ahead. The climb is consistent and scenic. Approaching Waterman Ridge. Crossing into the San Gabriel Wilderness. The trail continues along the wilderness boundary. Approaching the summit. The summit is wide, and difficult to discern the true high point. The large boulder pile ahead seemed like as good a place as any. The summit boulders. Climbing the boulder pile. Since I came this far, might as well make it official. On the summit of Delight Peak, elevation, 7,570 feet. I was unable to perform a 360 view from there. Meanwhile, I wasn't sure if I found the actual highest point. However, I continued on to Double Delight Peak. Double Delight is a second peak bump on the ridge. Approaching Double Delight Peak. Approaching the highest boulders on the peak. Time to climb the summit boulders. On the summit of Double Delight Peak. Elevation, 7,560 feet. The summit looks out at Mount Waterman. The Summit 360.
returning along the same route. Viewing Bear Mountain from the trail. It is downhill all the way when returning. Negotiating the steep descent. It is much quicker coming back down. Approaching the parking area. Mission accomplished. Although this is a moderately challenging hike, it is also low mileage. Therefore it is best to pair this hike with another nearby one in order to appreciate a complete day in the Angeles National Forest.